Have you ever thought about what it would mean to grow old alone? Perhaps you imagine a peaceful life without disturbing noises or interruptions, where you don't have to answer to anyone, an image of tranquility, freedom, and independence. But is that really what awaits you? Behind this vision, there may be less obvious aspects, rarely discussed. Living alone can indeed offer a sense of liberation, and this is partially true. However, there are also lesser known realities that one only discovers when experiencing them firsthand. Today, we would like to talk to you about the often underestimated truths about loneliness in old age. Not to discourage you, but to offer a realistic and hopefully helpful perspective. Our goal is to prepare you for the challenges you may face while showing you how to make the most of this experience. We have gathered testimonies from people who have already gone through this stage of life, and we want to share with you 10 lessons they have learned about growing old alone. These insights could help you better anticipate and experience this time with more serenity. Despite the challenges, living alone can also be very fulfilling, provided you are well prepared. If you have ever wondered what your old age might look like in solitude, this space is for you. Don't forget to subscribe to the Happiness is Feasible channel to not miss any of our upcoming videos on personal and spiritual development. Let's start with the first point. One. You need to be your own first responder. When growing old alone, you quickly realize that you can only rely on yourself in case of an emergency. If you fall ill or have an accident, no one will notice immediately, which can pose a real risk. Many choose to keep their phone with them at all times, even in the shower, and consider investing in alert devices or smartwatches capable of sending distress signals. Installing an emergency key safe accessible to trusted people can also be a simple but effective solution. Second, loneliness. Living alone may seem ideal for those seeking tranquility, and it can indeed be. However, even the most introverted individuals may end up feeling lonely, especially when social interactions become rare. Friends may drift away or simply be less available. Spending days without real conversation can become common but this isn't always good for emotional balance. Even introverts need some level of human connection, however minimal. In such situations, a pet can prove to be a valuable solution. Having a dog, cat, or even another companion not only provides a comforting presence, but also encourages a daily routine. It prompts you to interact with a living being, thereby reducing the feeling of loneliness. Three, maintaining the house can become overwhelming. When you're young, maintaining your home seems like a relatively simple task, but as you grow older, it can become increasingly difficult. Ordinary chores like cleaning, fixing a leak, or mowing the lawn can start to feel exhausting, even insurmountable. Physical fatigue combined with possible age-related limitations can make some tasks nearly impossible to manage alone. Don't feel guilty about asking for help. It may be wise to hire someone for the more tiring tasks or even delegate some responsibilities to family members. Downsizing, such as moving to a smaller place, can also relieve much of the stress related to home maintenance. Fourth routine becomes your anchor. When you live alone, your daily life often revolves around your habits, and over time, these routines become even more crucial. They provide you with a sense of stability, anchor you in the present, and create a structure essential for your mental well-being. Small daily actions, like making coffee, going for a walk, or reading a book, take on special meaning and help you stay connected to yourself. This consistency helps manage loneliness by giving you a form of control over your days. 5. Cooking just for yourself may seem pointless, but it's important. It may seem futile to cook only for yourself, especially when living alone. However, cooking is not just a way to nourish yourself, it is also an act of self-care. Preparing a meal, even a simple one, can become a gesture of self-love and self-worth. You don't need to make elaborate dishes. Opt for easy, nutritious recipes that you enjoy. This can turn cooking into an enjoyable moment and help you maintain a healthy diet while taking care of yourself. Six, silence can be both relaxing and heavy. The silence that comes with solitude can be a blessing, 
but also a curse. During the day, it can be calming, offering a welcome break after years of a hectic life. However, as night falls, this silence can become heavy, almost palpable, and amplify the feeling of loneliness. Many find comfort in leaving the TV or radio on or listening to podcasts. This helps create a warmer atmosphere and fills the sonic void that at times can be overwhelming. 7. Physical activity requires more effort. When you live alone without anyone to motivate you, it's easy to fall into a sedentary routine. You no longer have company to encourage you to go out, take walks, or exercise, and this can lead to a decrease in physical activity. But physical activity becomes even more important with age. Regular movement not only helps maintain a healthy body, but also keeps the mind sharp and alert. Finding ways to stay active, even in a moderate way, is crucial for overall well-being. A simple daily walk, a few morning stretches, or even joining a senior-friendly class can make a big difference. The key is to develop a routine that promotes movement and keeps your mind engaged. 8. Time can become elusive. Living alone without regular professional or social obligations can alter your perception of time. You may sometimes feel like the days stretch on endlessly or conversely pass by surprisingly fast. To avoid feeling lost in this new dynamic, creating a weekly routine can help structure your time. Organize your days by incorporating fixed activities, such as grocery shopping, cleaning the house, or dedicating time to your hobbies. This will give you a sense of control and help you maintain a more regular and balanced routine. 9. Decluttering, a liberating but emotionally challenging act. Living alone sometimes leads to facing the accumulation of objects and memories. Letting go of these items can be emotionally charged, as each object may be tied to a memory or an important moment. However, reducing what is unnecessary can also be a source of liberation. Decluttering your space allows you to live in an environment that reflects the person you are today, not just who you were. It may be difficult at first, but as you progress, this process will enable you to breathe more freely, both physically and emotionally. 10. Social opportunities may decrease, but you can create your own moments of joy. Over time, your opportunities for socializing may become rarer. This isn't necessarily due to a lack of interest from others, but more because family and professional obligations take up more space in the lives of your loved ones. Rather than waiting for someone to reach out, take the initiative. Invite a friend for coffee, start a book club, or plan weekly movie nights. By being proactive, you stay socially active and can shape your social life according to your preferences and passions. And what about you? Have you ever thought about what life would be like as you grow old alone? Perhaps you are already living this reality or preparing to face it. Either way, it's important to be aware of the potential challenges to better anticipate them. It's not just about overcoming difficult moments, but also finding practical solutions, creating routines that bring stability and well-being, and appreciating the small things that make each day unique. Growing old alone is not a fate, but rather an opportunity to discover more about yourself, take care of yourself, and enjoy the freedom it brings. It is equally essential to understand that you don't have to manage everything by yourself. Asking for help, maintaining social relationships, and ensuring your safety are key to leading a peaceful and fulfilling life. Every challenge can be met with a little planning and a healthy dose of awareness. If you relate to these situations or want to share your own experience, feel free to leave a comment below. Your thoughts and stories can inspire others who are living or about to live through this phase of life. Thank you for watching this video. If you found this content helpful or insightful, we invite you to give it a like and subscribe to the Happiness is Feasible channel. It helps us a lot. Share this video with anyone who you think could benefit from it. See you soon for the next video.